I'm gonna fucking spoil it for you, see. When I was growing up, there was all this, all this nuclear paranoia shit, hmm? All this, if the fucking air raid warning came, what would you do if you only had three minutes to live? If I only had three minutes to live, I'd carry on just as I am, wouldn't I, huh? Because in three minutes time, I'm gonna be fucking in heaven. Ah, <laughs> oh, fucking love that. Three minutes time. I'm gonna be fucking the fittest trick in the whole bastard world. So, fuck all that. Will he get a, won't he get a fucking bullshit? I'm telling you now, this all ends with me pulling a perfect girl. Yeah. Anyway, I had fuck all to do until a crucial business appointment at 10. So, flicked on Crime Watch. Occupied myself giving detailed descriptions of people I fucking hate to detectives working this harrowing multiple murder case. <laughs> Things were half past nine, I had to give up. Provided Her Majesty's Thickus with 142 invaluable fucking leads. <laughs> it was starting to get a bit fucking suspicious, you know what I mean? <laughs> My voice is kind of familiar from somewhere. So, I fucked off out the house and headed to the boar's head. A very different kind of crime was taking place. Not your straightforward everyday breaking of the law of the land. Not a crime against humanity. No, it's much fucking worse than that. Crime against fucking disco.